Greetings Americans, the quintessential element of our success financially, economically as a United States is to use extraterrestrial trading, intergalactic trading, trading ETs, ETs, and tech. Greetings good Americans, when we are nice to plants, animals, extraterrestrials, and microbes, all life forms, even natural resources that have life through them, we win for ETs, win. Great and good Americans, the United States will be so rich because my main goal of money is for the secret space program, uh, galactic trade. So we'll be trading with ET. So all of your companies will have super ET technology, super ET help information. Great and good Americans, we're going to have so much extraterrestrial support as a country. We will redefine ourselves as a nation of nations and a nations of nation. ET is American number one in world history permanently. Let's go vote for Tanya. Greetings, good Americans. We need to support extraterrestrials because they have the tools, the technology to cure our weather, to cure the ocean from excessive plastic, to cure places of drought. They have weather technology. We now need our help with ET. Greetings, good Americans. In 2050, my presidency will be an ET Alliance presidency. I, Shepard, born at the Harmonic Convergence, have a close relationship with extraterrestrials in the future. Let's go future. Greetings, good Americans. I want us to give the same rights we give to American-born individuals to extraterrestrial American-born individuals. Those born in the United States as extraterrestrial should have the same citizenship rights. Greetings, good Americans. I want to be the best diplomat with hollow earth civilizations. I have until my presidency. I have a little while. Are you going to help me to be the best diplomat? with hollow earth civilizations and extraterrestrials together, let's go. Greetings Americans, do we want media from hollow earth civilizations? Yes we do. We will have media from hollow earth civilizations 24 hours a day, all day, available to the American public, from us to ourselves to us. Greetings and Americans, let's start the extraterrestrial equal rights movement. No racism towards extraterrestrials, equal rights in the United States. Open area, shared to all. For sure. All ET. Greetings Americans, we're going to let extraterrestrials be safe in the United States. The United States will be a guard for extraterrestrials. We will allow them to be safe here. On planet Earth, you want to be safe here in ET. Come to pl come. Greetings Americans, let's make the United States the cosmic base for extraterrestrials on planet Earth. If there's one location where you can fly around and be safe from battle, and be here in prosperity and health and nurture. As much as it is a guarantee that I will be a world leader and president of the United States, we will protect extraterrestrials on planet Earth. My campaign is based on extraterrestrial rights very strongly. Let's go, America. Greetings, good Americans. The future of planet Earth in restoration is in the hands of extraterrestrials and all Earth civilizations. I am bringing this to us. Vote for Henry Thomas Borno, that's me. Great and good Americans with communication with extraterrestrials as will be in my presidency. We'll make Americans the smartest people on planet Earth, the most gifted people on planet Earth. We'll have so much great information and we really will be the leaders of information teaching. Great and good Americans, I will allow extraterrestrials to build cities for us Americans and I will allow us to live in these cities. So if they want to build circular gear cities, floating islands on the sea. Let's go for it. Green and good Americans will make so much money with extraterrestrial support that we really will have a comfortable nation during my presidency. This is my due promise to us in America. Green and good Americans, we will make ETs feel very safe with Americans. We will train Americans usually through media and through communication first by extraterrestrials using huge resources by the US government to really be one at one. Great and good Americans, the best countries are the most advanced. America will be the most advanced country possible because extraterrestrials and their groups which are super advanced will advance us and we will be advanced. Great and good Americans, I want to be and will be the founding father for extraterrestrial help on planet Earth. There you go. I want them to help us. I want us to help them. We As president, I will enlighten the American people. I will bring extraterrestrial advancement to the American people. I will lead the American people with an executive branch separate from the military. We're going to win. Great and good Americans, when Agarthans have good relations with the United States, 
we have so much to improve and that will be improved. Good weather, good environment, good technology, good people, good attitudes, good times. Great good Americans, let's make the United States of America the most spiritual, extraterrestrially advanced place on planet Earth, literally to unite the Earth into this great plethora of American greatness. Green and good Americans, our extraterrestrial alliance will be so supported and so powerful that we'll be a United States that is spread all over the galaxy. Remember, American government all over the galaxy, understood by the people living today. Green and good Americans, as an independent, I will not be lodged within a group like a political party. Therefore, I will have plenty of ability to find my own best answers and solutions for us from extraterrestrials, remember that. Green and Americans will have exceptional friendships with hollow Mars civilizations. We'll be in the peace of kindness and maturity. We'll have amazing medicines, amazing breakthroughs. In civilization advancements, we'll be a great American people, I know it. Green and Americans, to secure trade, we must secure the residency of extraterrestrials here in the United States so they can help us with that which they're trading with us. We need them for the material we're receiving, obviously. Greeting Americans, I would like Americans to be allowed to live in extraterrestrial areas with extraterrestrials and I would like that to be perfectly allowed and for that we'll have a relationship that will make it easy that Americans can go live in Agartha. Greeting Americans, I want to hire beautiful extraterrestrials to work with the Secret Service to protect the executive branch of the United States of America because extraterrestrials, I think, can do a really good job at it. Greeting Americans, it is important that extraterrestrials in groups are in peace with each other. And I believe that with my help, we will be able to bring galactic peace. And galactic peace to me is one of the most important things to know. Greeting Americans, when America helps extraterrestrials with each other, to be peaceful, we gain peace ourselves and we gain great advantages in the life that they can teach us to flourish into. In my life, we will have galactic peace. Great and good Americans, our goal is to make the globe purely democratic into a pure democracy. Together, we can work to make the globe of the people. The people vote for what the people want all over the world for very important things. Let's go. Great and good Americans, when I'm president, I will utilize the best extraterrestrial technology to give power to the United States, special power devices, so we may have less cost of electricity. I will not focus on the income of the government. We will be using some of the best extraterrestrial technologies to give the United States a super boost. I am sure that our productivity with these technologies will allow us to be a lot more financially sound and safe. Greetings, good Americans. I will utilize extraterrestrial technology, extraterrestrial information to make the United States the most futuristic place on Earth. When I'm president, we'll have a lot of extraterrestrial advancement and we will definitely help each other win. Greetings, good Americans. Let's make the United States the healthiest place on Earth. I want us to gather information from extraterrestrials involving the medicines of planet Earth and their innovations and their inventions in, in medicine, their research, the beautiful medicine that can allow the Americans to be the healthiest people. Greetings, Americans. I would like to expand our internet to fulfill the internet of hollow moon and hollow Mars and hollow Earth. I want our internet to be connected to these internets so we may have a free good time. Greetings, Americans. I want to install arboretums across the United States with extraterrestrial plants. Plants gathered from extraterrestrial environments I want to grow within the United States so we may visit, learn, love, and protect. Greetings, Americans. We will utilize extraterrestrial technology to purify ocean water, lake water. We will bring purification back to our water systems to give water to the world. Together, we have an ability to trust our extraterrestrial relationships and developments that promote human unity. Good. Green Americans, we will help as an American government tax deductible nonprofit organizations for extraterrestrials that when they come to the United States, they can have nonprofits to help them all the way. Green Americans, during my presidency, the United States of America will be the leader of extraterrestrial relationships on planet Earth, the governing of extraterrestrial relations will be through the United States government by me, the great president. Great Americans, when I'm president, I will work hard that extraterrestrials have the same rights in the United States as regular American citizens and voyagers as migrants 
and those who are here traveling. The laws of the United States will be applied to extraterrestrials in great variety. Amen. Greeting Americans, extraterrestrial forces in my ability will be based in the United States for the above level of planet Earth will be able to continue and maintain positive relationships while allowing the United States to be the positivity of the galaxy. Greeting in Americans, the United States will be the intermediary of peace to extraterrestrial groups. We will be the peace bringer to ET groups here in the United States. We will have efforts with the common people to come up with the best solutions to bring peace to extraterrestrials. Greeting in Americans, I will make sure that extraterrestrial religions and belief systems, philosophies, will be available to the American people and the world through the American people. We want to understand what the galaxies understand, and for that, we'll have a lot of opportunities for world peace. Great Americans, here's a solution. How will I bring extraterrestrial cooperation for the United States in a very great degree? I'm not going to be involved with the military. Therefore, my powers will be able to be focused on the galaxy and not on the military as president. I will be independent from the military and pro extraterrestrial advancement. Let's go do this. Greeting Americans, when I am president at public universities of the United States, we will have as options to learn extraterrestrial languages of a few different types. Greeting Americans, when I am president, we will learn about extraterrestrial life. As much as they are studying us, we'll be studying them together. We'll have a lot of knowledge and wisdom all over the galaxy and the universe. We will learn about extraterrestrial lives. Great and good Americans and great and good extraterrestrials, we will learn of the depth of what is good and sincere for communities all across the universe. And I want to learn how to create in the United States, around the globe, and all over the universe, decent communities, decent lives for everybody. Great Americans, let's increase extraterrestrial safety in the United States, that we may have a protection a program for extraterrestrials, they may come and be safe. We can learn to help them, protect them with health, nurturing, advancement, and love. Great American, let's create American-based nonprofit organizations to develop cuisine, food that extraterrestrials enjoy, that when they come to the United States, we may have food ready for them and supplies for nutrition and perhaps even medicine that they may need to have a good, comfortable, smooth ride. Great Americans, let's create jobs for extraterrestrials in the United States that they may have ways to make their own money. So let's create job opportunities all over the United States, in every county, in every state, for extraterrestrials that they may work with you, make some money, so they can have enjoyment on planet Earth. Greeting on Americans, I and we want the top level of planet Earth to be as one with hollow Earth. Therefore, we'll do our best with extraterrestrial support that we may then be trusted and accountable and responsible. Greeting Americans, let's open up trade with hollow earth, multilaterally, all levels and spectrums of society. We are sure that we can have ample goods from hollow earth to make our life super good, super comfortable, and those advancements will raise the U.S. economy dramatically. Let's go in. Greeting Americans, let's prepare planet earth to be one with hollow earth. Let's prepare. Therefore, we need to have the government style of direct democracy. We should have ample voting to let the people decide. Because when the people decide, we Great win. Americans will unite the United States with the rest of the galaxy and galaxies surrounding. That way we'll have the best of every world. Great and good Americans, let us apply our constitution to extraterrestrials. To include extraterrestrials in our own constitution. That way we may have the best world for us here as the United States.